Welcome back guys to Let's Build a Server episode 6. Uh, last episode we worked on the um, the last man standing um, arena, I guess you can call it. Uh, today we're going to be working on a, another game mode. We're going to call it, um, let's get to the middle of this block here. Look straight. We're going to call it slash set warp death race. And let me adjust my mic. Sorry if I'm talking uh, quiet, but it's really light here. And if we do warp death race, we should teleport here. So I've already kind of um, created a little uh, area here, or a little um, starting warp place. But um, basically what this is going to be is, for example, people would run out of this door right here. And it's basically like a race, and you can kill each other, and whoever gets to the end first and alive basically um, wins the game. So um, we're going to go ahead and get started, and the beginning is going to take a little bit of redstone. So we're going to go and get this uh, sticky piston and a lever. So um, how this is going to work is we're actually going to have to have a piston right about here I believe facing upward onto this block and we want that piston to be uh, powered so we're going to go or actually we can probably even just put a lever right there like so and um we can just leave it like that and if we were in warp death race you know players can't get out and it, we'd broadcast like you know uh you could be like three or four three two one or whatever and uh once you hit one you just flip the switch and they can pass the door and they can uh go into the race and once they pass the line, they'll be able to pvp of course after like using world guard to uh set the flags and stuff for the areas so um we're gonna go ahead and get started building this we're gonna make it a um kind of like a cave style um still not exactly sure how i want to build this though so um we're going to see what we can do at the beginning. We're going to use world edit, but here at the beginning, we can't because we don't want to affect that building at all. So we're going to come out a little bit like so. And then, you know, maybe create like a kind of like a little, uh, a little, um, like wall thing here. Like so maybe come out a little bit and go in a little bit and stuff like that like that and we'll do the same over here like that now um we have kind of this basic uh cave down here we're going to go ahead and bring these walls up a little bit and then we'll start using some uh, some world edit. Just in a second here. We'll focus on the roof to all this later, but uh, we want to go ahead and get this um this basic uh this basic race down. So we're going to get our wand actually we're going to get a different wand, a uh, brush. And want to go brush let's go cylinder for now cylinder um let's do uh stone let's do four and um basically what we're gonna do is we're just gonna you know kind of bring it out like this maybe do a few uh shapes and whatnot but we're gonna come up maybe up some if we can get that to work do undo because we want this to right here to go up like that and uh, maybe up a little bit more and then we'll um 
we'll work in here a little bit like maybe put some lava fire and stuff like that make some like small little crevices that people have to go into and uh you know basic stuff like that uh we'll put another block of stone there we want to make this as hard as possible for people to get through so um, what we're gonna do is we're gonna bring it around go out a little bit maybe make another uh, uphill thing here do the same again we'll do kind of like a little circle here in a second once we get ourselves up and around and uh... looks like this is going to be about good if we come out maybe then we can go here uh... up right here then we'll just go across boom and we will start going down here in a second like right now uh... what we're gonna do is we're gonna go down in a circle now i think or we could just go straight down like this if i don't glitch out like that but uh, let's go forward a little bit and i'm not exactly sure how long i want this to be but let me check my phone real quick Hold on a second, guys. I'm gonna gotta send a text message real quick. Sorry about that, but um, let's keep going. We'll go one more because we want some flat areas. Like for example, maybe like a little lava pit right there. Because we want we want it to be like kind of uh easy for people to die, or I guess you can say like hard for people to uh to finish the race without dying. And uh, you also got to keep in mind that PvP is enabled throughout all of this. So that's something to keep in mind. Can maybe go like that and then come out a little bit. Put some twists and curves in it. Like so. Uh, maybe go down a little bit more. Like so. Let's go uh, out a little bit. And um, we'll probably go like out to out there somewhere. Um, maybe like a 300 or 400 block long thing. I'll focus on the walls and stuff and then we can um, we can do the inside together. So um, I will tell you what, since you guys see what we're basically doing here, we're just kind of making a pathway. I'm going to go ahead and finish this. Um, I'm going to keep doing the same kind of like um, strategy I'm using, just kind of all over the place. And um, I will come back to you guys because this is going to be uh, pretty repetitive and boring. And um, I'll pr I might even do the walls, I'm not sure, but uh, the walls should be repetitive and boring too. But uh, as you can see, like it's kind of like a twisty pattern here up and down maybe like some small little crevices that you have to get through like this you know it could be cool but uh, I'll be back in one second welcome back guys um this is actually well I've, I've finished the um the closing off of the death race and um I'm actually recording this a few days later so I'm kind of lost here but um it looks uh, pretty ugly from the outside, but you'll see here. I'll show you this right now. I've made this um this little finish area. Um, they drop down here and they can't fight anymore when they have finished the race. But we're gonna go ahead and go to where you spawn. Uh, you spawn right here. I've closed all of it off. Made it gave it kind of a um a cave feel. These torches are temporary. And um, we're going to go ahead and get started, make it a little bit more challenging in here. So we're going to get rid of all of this. We're actually going to keep some stone on us, though. 
Uh, so let's get some netherrack. Uh, flint and steel. Mm, what else can we get? We can get a lava bucket. Mm, maybe some cobwebs. Uh, some ladders. And maybe some uh, some fences, possibly. Uh, no, let's leave the fences for now. But um, we're gonna go ahead and start off by right when they get onto the um into the arena, they have to pass this fire here, which will catch them on fire. And um, I think that should work, right? If you pass through it, you should. Yep, you stay on fire. And, um, we'll leave it at like that. And you can see there's another little one by one area right here. So what we're going to do is we're going to place a cobweb right there. Uh, let's place it right there. So you should run through here and you should get stuck right in the cobweb. Uh, right here we will put a, a lava pool. Just a small little lava pool. Um, like this, and we can go ahead and do that, and maybe right here, we can go something like this, maybe like a ladder going up, um, maybe um, we gotta make it a little challenging so because we don't want a million people finishing this race so we can put some fire in a few different places maybe another uh, lava pit coming down like this big lava pit right here boom and let's go open this little hole and close it off. So we'll go ahead and make that lava. Let's see if we can fix that. All right, there we go. And uh, we'll place some more fire right there. Maybe a few cobwebs like this. Mm, maybe another one right there. Make this kind of like a little mazy area. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and toggle downfall off because I can hear it. Uh, let's put some more fire, maybe right here. Maybe they'll catch it. Um, maybe some more right there. Uh, another cobweb right there. Mm, we can do a lava pit like this they have to cross it I mean they could oops they could possibly jump over it but it'd be a little tough and uh, you come into like this kind of close area here uh, we can go ahead and put another two fire things here maybe a cobweb there one there too um Go ahead and put more fire there and there. Um, there should be like a straightaway thing coming up here pretty soon. We're going to go ahead and make kind of a cobweb maze here. Like so. Uh, maybe some more fire right here. Some more right here maybe. And we'll go ahead and do put a um a big lava pit right there. Boom. And uh, I'm not really sure how long the episode's running, but um, cause uh, like I said, I recorded the, the first half of this uh, maybe like two or three days ago, cause um I ran out of time. Got kind of a, um, a lava pit like that. Which looks pretty cool. Um, we can put some of these. Maybe some fire right there. Oop, not lava. 
like so. Uh, maybe some more cobwebs right there. Some fire. Like so. Lava pit. Oof. Um, next episode we will probably work on the, um, the shop. Go ahead and get that lava, I keep doing that, I'm not really sure why. We'll go ahead and get that lava pit down. Um, let's make this too high. So they have to, um, have to go through the lava pit this time. You know, they can't really jump across it. So that means we will go ahead and put a block right there. Like so. Oh, I don't think they can jump across that. Nope. Um, so we'll go ahead and do this. Um... Some fire again, maybe some cobwebs right there. And this is where we have a straight, like a straightaway thing. So um, we're going to clear out some space on the roof. And what we're going to do is we're going to use this stone here. We're going to put some some uh another rack like so and then some stone right there we'll put a ladder there oop not cobwebs and uh, we got to go up a little bit higher it looks like so we'll come up like this cobwebs a oop cobwebs across like that so you should come up, cobwebs, and then you should fall down into a um, a lava pit like this. If I can go ahead and, uh, oop. my keyboard's been um acting up again. Might need uh, new batteries or something. Because the keys seem to be sticking, not on the uh, actual keyboard, but like, they're sticking for some reason. And there we go. And we will put some more cobwebs going across, like so. And then, we'll put some fire. Then we'll go ahead and do another um uh, another little um thing that we like we just built there. So we'll do fire all the way across, and then uh hold on. We'll then we'll put a too high um. It's kind of hard to see with all the smoke there. But um, it should be a too high thing of stone and ladders all the way across. Go ahead and delete that part right there. And then we will need to do this. And then cobwebs across. And then some more cobwebs like so. And we will go ahead and put maybe a little lava thing right there. We'll do that in a few different places. Like we are here. Um, maybe a cobble right there. Some uh, another rack there. Cobble up there and there there this looks like a good um 
spot for some uh, lava. So we'll go ahead and do that. And um, we should be over halfway done with it now, maybe like three quarters. I'm not exactly sure how uh how big it is, but do something to uh, kind of slow them down here. And uh, we'll put some more uh, netherrack, some cobwebs, and sorry about that, but we'll put some cobwebs right there, mm. some, uh, some more right here, when you jump in them you go a lot slower. I've uh, I've found so we'll keep on going here and uh, let's go ahead and put a lava pool right here so they can either jump across it or they can um, get through it and then here we have another um another straightaway and right here we're gonna do kind of a um maybe like a lava maze or something like that so we can kinda go across like that maybe there back all the way across bang bang boom and here what we're doing is we're just kinda making a um something that they kinda have to jump over oops or something like that And um, what we can do for this area is we can just take our um, our wand and we'll just come all the way across, so like right here. Let me go up and we'll do set stone. And we'll just place lava in each of these. I think there's a little hole right there too, so why not? And uh, this section here should be pretty hard to get through. Oh, I, I can't go through one thing without doing that, I guess. But, we'll, did it again. <laughs> but um, we'll go ahead and finish this up. I can't even get through it with fly and stuff, so... It's gotta be hard to get through it with, um with uh, regular game mode we're gonna go and make this three high too so the players can jump like so and there we go so that should be a pretty tough area there we'll put some cobwebs there Actually, only in one spot. Um, maybe some stuff there, there, there. And then we're going to do a big row of cobwebs here. And some more right here. And a final little row of them right there. And uh, here is the finish line. So that should be a pretty good, um, let's try it out ourselves. So, you know, this thing, I have it down right now, so it's easier, but, um, we'll go through, let's actually, um, CI, uh, GM0, let's try, um, kits, or kit, we'll, uh, do kit PVP. We only have that many soups, so I'm going to give us some more because the players are going to have a full inventory so we'll do um give it 282.64 so I should yeah I have 64 here they're stacked but um we'll go ahead and do that 
and we'll go here so let's pretend that we're racing through we do have and you got to remember we do have people uh fighting us here so you got this lava here here boom you hit the fire again more lava you could possibly fall on that cobwebs you can go ahead and stew get through all this hit the fire again more cobwebs and this is the spot where i believe most players will have some trouble and i'm just gonna run through this but what it looks like to me is we might need to add a little bit more fire i'm not sure but uh yeah I think it will be pretty fun. Here they have to go all the way through. You know, you throw out your soups, resoup. And here is a tough part right here. You know, you still got people fighting you while you're in the cobwebs and stuff. And then you gotta hit these again you can even get through it <laughs> and more cobwebs this part pretty slow as you can see actually very slow and we'll keep going I'll go ahead and do slashy but their hunger I'll use world guard to make sure their hunger does not go down in these areas Got some lava there. Little area to slow you down here. And uh, I'll put some more fire down through this area. And more cobwebs and more cobwebs. So um, it's a pretty long uh, race now that I, I'm doing it myself jump over that and this is where it gets a little tough you know it, the fire can um spark you anyways spark i don't really know what i'm saying but um here we got this and this and there you go so i went through about let's see how many i went through um probably about uh one and a half hot bars and then plus you got the people fighting you so it could be pretty fun but um i will leave that how it is right now and um that's gonna be the end of this episode so uh, i'll put some signs in here to tell people what to do and stuff but next episode We'll go to, um, let's do TP, it's negative, oops, negative, if I can type my name right, negative 10,000, uh, 150, negative 10,000, and it says there's a hole in the floor, so I don't really know I'm going to TP myself there, but, um, what we will do is we'll work on the shop next episode and uh, I'll see you guys then.